It was always a dream to be the first to fly around the world at the equator. 27,000 miles, an incredible aerial journey for the 1930s. No one had ever done it, and now a woman would be the first. That woman was Amelia Earhart. This new Lockheed is the realization of a dream. In May 1937, Amelia Earhart took off on the flight that was to be the crowning achievement of her career. Six weeks later, she and her navigator, Fred Noonan, disappeared without a trace in the South Pacific. She's so well known, and she just disappears off the face of the earth. Well, that can't be. What kind of an ending is that? Sixty years after Amelia's final flight, a team led by Texas aviator Linda Finch painstakingly restored a Lockheed Electra and set out to recreate and relive Amelia's round-the-world adventure. Now, this is the uh, critical point. Navigator Bowen Weishite has carefully studied Earhart's last flight and believes he may have solved the mystery of her disappearance. If she had kept on going, she would have overflown that island in 15 minutes, about. But she didn't. This is the story of Amelia Earhart's last flight in which we'll discover what may have happened in the final hours.